these are the initial looks of the wind tunnel facility that you are going to see at JOET. Now this is from the faculty side, the faculty accommodation side. Let me take you uh, to the main or the side view because after a few more months, hardly one month or so, you will not be able to see anything like this. Things will be covered, things, things will be totally polished, chiseled and uh, you know will be put forwarded for the people to do research and a lot of other things. In just a moment. There are a few LTs also that are coming up. This is These are the new developments that you are seeing now. And these are some of the fantastic things. I mean, we can have a huge number of classes that can be taken up here. And it is just right in front of the boys' hostels as well as just beside the, uh, what should I say, the, our power station. Now, this is the first initial, I mean, the first glimpse of the GOT mega structure that I was talking about. You can even see the... Uh, th these are called the thrusters or in fact uh, the blowers of the wind I don't have much of ideas but you can just have a look look at this massive building which will hold the classes the lectures and might be the sitting places of some of the faculties look at the blocks that are lying here after a few days you're not going to see all these things the booms the beams look at these beams the steel structures, these are one of the finest structures that you might ever see at the JOD campus. Now, the initial view of, what should I say, it is, it looks much uh, like a jet engine with something inside it. I'll give you uh, much more overviews about what is this. Well, let me tell you, I, I also become very, very excited when I first saw it. And the best part is, when it was getting... Uh, inside the campus there was very less space inside the gate I mean in the gate so that it can be taken inside the gate was dismantled for almost uh, two to three days then somehow it was managed and it was kept inside now see how these uh, this whole structure has been fa fashioned up properly over these uh, what should I say the concrete columns have a look You can even see a massive crane which is right in front of you. This crane holds back a lot of cubes and takes them higher. Now this is how you are going to see the things if you are inside it. Look at the roof. Look at the roof. At the roof the beams or the steel uh, trusses whatever you say these trusses are lifted by use of cranes and they are gradually placed placed on top of these massive steel columns or steel structures that you can see now you can even see the bases of it they are so massive having almost three three six bolts a huge thing in it now these are the boys horses that you can see right in front of you another glimpse of the blower in fact uh, I should say this is the thing that will force the air uh, inside the test area where we can have a lot of aerodynamic tests uh, on the buildings as well as might be on uh, certain prototypes or models of airplanes or cars or a lot of other things just have a look stuff kind of a thing which will act as a thruster and it will act as an exhaust nozzle kind of a thing of, 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 of a jet engine you will have hypersonic or even supersonic wind flows which will have its impact on various aerodynamic models and might be this will be the place later on in future where you'll be seeing a lot of structures lying a lot of experimental setups and it is just beside the electrical substation you can see the substation there it's just beside the substation as well as the generator room. You can see a part of the generator room here. See how it is being constructed. A lot of things are here. And the best part, the, the building which will hold the students as well as the faculty members. Let me uh, give you a brief view of it. Just a moment. Hold on. Now this is how the things will look like.